Our first guest is the author of The Very Vera Cookbook, and she's also the host of The Very Vera Show. And today she is in our kitchen baking a classic Very Vera hummingbird cake. Please welcome Vera Stewart to our home. We're so excited to have you here, Vera. Also joining us, the legendary, the incomparable, the amazing, the one and only Dionne Warwick. <laughs> We are so honored to have you here. When we told Vera, she, like Ken, also began to cry. Uh, and I said, what the world needs now is, is more nice. hummingbird. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> and Love Sweet Love. We'll go with Love Sweet Love as well. So your new, your new cookbook celebrates all things Southern, including the hummingbird cake. Now, I've seen a lot of hummingbirds in my life, and they don't look like this cake. Why is that well, called a hummingbird the cake? The hummingbird cake is very sweet, has a lot of things in it that would actually attract a hummingbird, Aww. and a lot of hungry people. Mm -hmm. Yes. Aww, so that's kind so of where sweet. the twist comes from with it. And it's really delicious and moist and has a lot of interesting sort of ingredients in here. So you exactly. guys dig in. Um, we've given you extra large pieces, so you don't have to eat it all. So in, in um, the mixing bowl now, we have have sugar, eggs, oil, and also an interesting ingredient. Banana. Banana. You know, those bananas that are going oh. ripe and you don't know what to do with them, you're going to make a hummingbird cake. Okay. So you chop them up and you just beat this up and it gets really creamy. Mm -hmm. You won't see any of the oil anymore, so that just works okay. really you, well. You add the dry ingredients, which also has some interesting so this spice is in there. Cake flour, salt, baking soda, and a little bit of cinnamon. So is that that's traditional hummingbird cake? They put cinnamon in it? You love it? You love it? Oh, my God. It's, it's really sweet. The cinnamon. It is a very sweet cake. So the cinnamon kind of cuts a little bit of the sweetness. And then it's it's very much like a spice cake. Oh, interesting. Um, you know, you would think about this maybe um, for something where you had a lighter meal because it, it's, a, it's a very sweet cake. And it's interesting that you use oil and not butter. That's right. So it's a, so it's a healthy. quick cake. Well, it, it, you know, probably. Healthier. Use, healthier than butter and then it doesn't it maintains its moisture for quite a while with the oil sure so this is just I'm gonna turn this okay, up just a ahead. little bit more I always get a little a nervous little that it's gonna around, yeah that it's gonna around flour and as you can see I'm using a measuring cup just because it makes it easier to kind of add this a little bit at a time so you wouldn't just just do like I do and the flour is <laughs> just going well everywhere. I do that and then I we, cover it with a dish towel we both have on white blouses <laughs> so why. that would help yeah so eventually this all comes together we would add all the dry ingredients right and I could probably Add just a little oh, bit more. There you oh, go. Just yeah, go ahead. Just dive Crazy. in. Just dive Get in. wild. <laughs> okay, so that looks pretty good. So that good. we do that. We have it come together pretty quickly. And then we're going to lift that up and have two more wonderful southern ingredients. This is pecans. And you know, I'm from Georgia. I know you can't tell. <laughs> no, but no, no, I'm from Georgia. Like and we're going to add here. that and some pineapple. So oh. enjoy, you say pecans, not pecans. That's right. I say pecans. Pecans, okay. All right, so I'm just folding this in. You don't want to do this part in the mixer, so you keep all that chunkiness of the in pineapple. There. So that's pineapple just straight out of the can, right? That's right. And do you leave, out of keep the, the juice from the can too? Uh, well, you drain it a little bit, but of course okay. a, a little bit will still stay. Okay. And now we've prepared a nine inch cake pan with a little bit of flour and oil um, and there, and then the parchment paper. And also, this is how many layers? Four? This is four layers. Okay. Not, enough. <laughs> Not enough. <laughs> you know, as it worked out, the the cake that's named after the smallest bird ever is the biggest cake. <laughs> <I've done. laughs> that's all right. So we are so going to. How, what is the trick to to make them all bake evenly? Because well, this makes four layers, okay. and of course, you want to kind of eyeball it, make sure it's. And you don't want to bring it all the way up to no, the top. No, about okay. leave about a half an inch, and then we're just gonna. Uh -huh pound it and you can see the bubbles kind of wow. lift out okay. and now it's going to go into a 325 degree oven for how long? For about 35 to for 40 35. minutes. Okay and then we take it out, we let it cool, right? Do you cool it in the refrigerator after you take well, it you out? Well you put it on a cake cooling rack okay. and then I like to cool it in the refrigerator so that it gets nice and it's not as crumbly to do the icing with so that makes it work well and then you do the crumb coat and then you do the crumb coat which I is have my to say, favorite um, this I is love the big reveal i love oh. the way you say cool say it cool. it's cool, cool. cool. It's cool. <laughs> i love it so this is the best part so oh, this is a crumb coated layer. 
And, you know, if you don't want to do this many layers, you could make two cakes and give one to a friend. Sure. No, no, that's the, no, no, that's no, the no, southern no, thing. No, that's no, the southern that's thing. The southern no. thing to do. And now we ice it with your, your traditional icing. That really is, this is your signature yeah. icing. Everybody knows yeah. you. For well, icing, it's, it's the signature of Very Vera, but actually this whole method was created by a lady that came to work in my bakery. Her daughter was my roommate at the University of Georgia. She was retired from her <laughs> she was retired from her Aww. other job. Her name was Kitty. A her kitty. kitty swirl cake is the way we iced every cake at Very Vera. And today is her 90th birthday. <laughs> Birthday cake. I mean, it's Aww. just it's, so many things keep happening um, that are great. And well, and why was this swirl a signature swirl of Ari Vera? Well, you know, you or this swoosh. What do we call it? A swoosh, a swirl. You know, the thing about our cakes is they were delicious. Yes, yes. they were. <laughs> but they were beautiful. Yes. Yes. And they were packaged <laughs> unbelievably. So part of what we wanted to ensure was when it was lifted out of the box when you received this in the mail that you could put it on the counter and tell all your friends you made it. Oh, I see. Uh, well, Vera, you know, Vera, Vera your, uh, your cakes aren't the only thing that you make, though. If we go to the book, we can see that you have some other specialties yes. as well. Yes, Not we do the best chicken pot pie ever. Oh, so oh my goodness. It, it is beautiful. delicious. Wow. And it can be made with a rotisserie chicken, so you don't even have to cook the chicken. Oh, how nice. nice. The <laughs> Bitsy's Meatloaf is my sister's recipe. Oh, that looks and good. if you yeah. love meatloaf, you have never had this. Lemon bar. Melt oh. in your mouth. Very tea party. Oh, Vera. I know. You're really that's talking so my nice. language. I like that. Very um, tea party. You said that that's the best part of this cake, but I'm going to say that this is the best part. It is so yeah. good. Yeah. So this is the way you do the top, and you just you know you can kind of do like it's this. It's very it's, calming to watch someone ice yes. the cake. It's just it's not that hard to do. And in so the was, book, we give you all the instructions oh, for that. everything. I'm telling you. It's here. Oh, what so this the is. world oh. is. <laughs> is cake. Sweet cake. <laughs> and this is sweet cake. Which oh, my god! Let's taste this. Vera. I gotta beautiful. Make sure, i got to make sure. That we did it right? <laughs> that we did it right. Let's test uh, it out. You good? That icing. Mm. Yes. Mm. So good. So good. Mm. Well, make sure you visit so Vera good. online at verivera.com and Woo. check out hallmarkchannel.com for this recipe. Listen. I earned this. I played <laughs> basketball with you earlier. I earned this. I'm going to go now. <laughs>